Skylark was a British-sounding rocket design. The Skylark was first launched in 1957 from Woomera, Australia and its 441st and final launch took place from S-Range, Sweden on 2 May 2005. Launches had been carried out from sites in Europe, Australia, and South America, with use far beyond the UK by NASA, the European Space Research Organisation ESRO, and German and Swedish space organisations. History The design first dates to 1955, when initial work was carried out by the Royal Aircraft Establishment at Farnborough and the Rocket Propulsion Establishment at Westcott. The first vehicles were ready less than two years later, and sent for testing to Woomera during the International Geophysical Year. During the 1960s Skylark evolved into an excellent platform for space astronomy, with its ability to point at the sun, moon, or a star. It was used to obtain the first good quality X-ray images of the solar corona. Within the UK national programme, the frequency of Skylark launches peaked at 20 in 1965 from Woomera, with 198 flights between 1957 and 1978. The first X-ray surveys of the sky in the Southern Hemisphere were provided by Skylark launches. It was also used with high precision in September and October 1972 in an effort to locate the optical counterpart of X-ray source GX3 plus 1 by lunar occultation. In 1975, the Federal Republic of Germany through the DFVLR now German Aerospace Center or DLR agreed with Australia to launch a Skylark rocket at Woomera for scientific purposes. The launch took place on 14 March 1975. This was followed by three more, launched on the 22nd of February 13, March 1979, and the 24th of August 1987. Skylarks were built in some numbers into the 1970s, until the UK government decided to end the programme in 1977, thinking that future, low-weight, research would be carried out on the Space Shuttle instead. The program was handed to British Aerospace, who later sold it to Matra Marconi Space, who in 1999 in turn sold it to a small private company, Sounding Rocket Services, based in Bristol. Topic. Description The basic Skylark is 7.6 meters, 25 feet long, 0.44 meters, 17 in in diameter and has a fin span of 0.96 meters, 38 in. Booster stages can increase the height to 12.8 meters, 42 feet. The original version was propelled by 840 kilograms, 1850 pounds of solid fuel, which enabled 45 kilograms, 99 pounds to be launched to an altitude of over 200 kilometers, 120 miles. Improvements were made to the engine and the use of a booster increased the payload to 200 kilograms, 440 pounds in 1960. Skylark 12, from 1976, could lift 200 kilograms 440 pounds to 575 kilometers 357 miles altitude. Due to its small mass and low thrust, the original version of the Skylark had to be launched from a 25 meters 82 feet tilting tower to overcome the effects of the wind. Later versions only required a simple trailer. Topic survivors Skylark rockets are on display in the following locations, University of Leicester, Department of Physics and Astronomy, Skylark Raven C, 1957, National Space Center in Leicester, Skylark Goldfinch Raven, Mullard Space Science Laboratory, Surrey, England, Skylark 7, Goldfinch 2, Raven 11, Rocketry Museum, Woomera, Australia, Skylark Nose Cone Only, Woomera Missile Park, Woomera, Australia, Cuckoo, Raven, the Euro Space Centre in Belgium, replica QVMAG, Launceston, Tasmania, Australia, Aerospace Bristol, Filton, Bristol, England. In the possession of Mexborough and Swinton Astronomical Society in South Yorkshire, England. Solna Strandvag 86, Stockholm, Sweden. Partly viewable from the waterfront. Topic. See also. 
Black Arrow Black Knight Blue Streak Missile Skylark Launch Tower <laughs>